everyone! Welcome back to Yellow Cottage Silvery. Tonight I am using a new fragrance. It is called Pineapple Mango. And because of the fragrance, I chose the colors yellow. I have a green-ish color. I have Soapberry Red and a little bit of Poppy Red uh, just to maybe mix with it. I'm not sure. They look similar. I don't want a red. I kind of want an orangey red. And... I don't know. I'm the base is going to be white. I know I'm going to pipe on the top. I'm going to use my one of my Russian ruffle tips. It is similar to the one I used in my last video, but this one is a little bit wider. It has a little wider squiggly. So I'm just going to play around with it, and I'm not sure of the design on the inside yet. I'm going to wait and see the consistency of the soap, and then I will decide. Um, I'm going to give this a quick stick blend because my kale and clay is in here, and then I'm going to go ahead and add my lye solution.
show you real quick what I am doing. Well, I don't know for sure what I'm doing, but I am using just plain old saran wrap because I was out of press and seal and the store didn't have any more. So hopefully this will work. I am just going to take the colors and line them up, kind of make them long so they fit down into my piping bag. And I'll probably make two of these because I don't know that it will all fit into one bag. So I probably fast forward through the part of me doing this, but I thought I would show you. I've shown it before, but some people, I guess, like to see uh, how, you, how I do the piping. So I saved quite a bit of each color on purpose. I'll probably put half of each on here. Um, I wish I had more of the white layer so that when I pulled the hanger through, it would show in the white more, but that is okay. I was on the fence if I wanted to save any white for this, and I decided to put add a little white in here. So I saved a little bit. Oh, this smells. If you've never had this, smelled this fragrance, if you're a soap maker or whatever, oh, it is magnificent. It is so just fruity and just tropical smelling. I love pineapples, so I love the smell. I love the taste. I love everything about pineapples, so I love this one. I hope other people love it too because I really would love to keep it in stock. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just add oh, a little bit of white. I didn't really save enough to do much with, but it was kind of a last minute decision. Is this bothering anyone else like it's bothering me? There's no way I can leave that there. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up and I'm going to make another one as similar to it as I can. saran wrap we don't we don't get along I don't really like saran wrap okay so I might just change the order here back and I'm going to this tip is kind of a wide ruffle tip and this isn't meant to be the top layer this is meant to when I cut it I want to see if it has any kind of waves or anything with the colors so I am just going to move this so you can see I'm just going to kind of let the colors come out and kind of do a ruffle. You really don't have to do anything except apply pressure and move along and it kind of does it itself. I think the green 
I don't know if the green is showing up yet. There's the green. This might look muddy and awful, but I just wanted to see. So I will be, I will put a couple layers of this or however much, however far this piping bag goes, and I will tap it down so that I don't want it to be, but to have air pockets, because this is still, you know, part of the inside of the soap. I was going to try to do this, like, as a layer down in, and I could have, because it thickened quickly, but I had read the reviews that said that it stayed pretty fluid, so I, I really wasn't prepared to switch it up and do this, but I thought this would be pretty, like, down inside. This is a little bit challenging right here. Okay, so I'm going to use the rest of this up. Kind of in between. to cut pineapple mango and that's the inside of the log and I love how the top is got the variegated colors like from the piping I was not happy with the way the piping turned out on this it just was wasn't really what I had in mind but I do love the inside I think that turned out pretty with the colors up here and then and it smells really nice Look at this one. Wait, let me focus the top. That looks so cool. So I'm actually very pleased with the way it turned out. Um, I didn't even take a picture of the top last night because I just didn't think it turned out that great. And so I'm really glad the inside looks good. the green okay. 
Okay guys, thanks so much for watching and I will see you all in the next video.